Hello everybody. In this video, you will learn how to create a sales order and also learn the different ways in which you can use them in Zoho Inventory. First, let us understand what a sales order is. A sales order is a document that you send to your customers to confirm the order for items that you are selling to them. It will contain details such as the price and the quantity of the items being sold. In this video, we will cover the following topics. Creating a sales order. Let's get started and see how to create a sales order. Log into Zoho Inventory. Go to the sales order module in the left sidebar. Click the plus icon next to the sales orders or the plus new button. Select the customer from the drop down. The sales order number will be auto populated. If you wish to change it, click the gear icon next to this field and mark the checkbox accordingly. You can also mention the reference number if you wish. The sales order date would be the current date by default. However, you can also choose any other date from the calendar. In the expected shipment date, you can enter the date by which the product should reach your customers. You can also choose the payment terms from the drop-down or click configure terms to add a new payment term. If you have enabled the salesperson field, you will find a salesperson tab where you can associate your salesperson. Alternatively, click manage salesperson and then click plus new salesperson to add a salesperson. Select the items from the item table and enter the rate, quantity and also choose the appropriate tax from the drop down. You can also add items in bulk by clicking the drop down next to plus add new row. Now, Select the items and click Add Items. Here, enter all the necessary information. Click Save as Draft if you wish to edit later or Save and Send to send it right away. Let's see some alternate ways to create a sales order. You can either create sales order directly from the customer's page or you can import them in bulk. To create a sales order from the customer's page, go to the customer's module on the left sidebar. Select the customer, click new transaction and select sales order from the drop down. Next, let's see how to bulk import sales order. Go to the sales order module on the left sidebar. Click the More icon and select Import Sales Order. You can refer to a sample file for the format of import. Click the Choose File button and select the file from your system. Now, if you have already created sales orders in Zoho Inventory and your import file also has these sales orders, they will be duplicates. You can choose whether to skip them or override the existing record with a new one. Click Next. Once you have uploaded the file, you can map the fields. If you want to save these selections for future imports, then mark this box and click Next. Make sure to check the preview and correct the errors if any. Now click Import. All the sales order that you create will be listed here. You can perform various other actions listed on this page such as Edit, Delete, Clone, Download as PDF, Add Attachments and even Print. With this, we hope you have a good understanding of how you can create sales orders. In the next video, we will see in detail about other activities related to sales orders in Zoho Inventory. If you have any queries, feel free to contact us at support at zohoinventory.com. Thank you.